This is a set of different color LEDs. And so if we dim the lights down, oh my God, I'm still cracking up at that cooler and I've owned it for 10 years. <laughs> Those of small brains are easily amazed. <laughs> That's okay. I'm usually happy. All right, so, because <laughs> it's a really small brain. All right, there's a white, <laughs> I gotta stop laughing. Here's a white LED. And, oh, that's so awesome. We can get the lights all the way down there. There's a purple LED. There's a blue LED. A green LED, maybe. Oh, well, maybe. Here, I'll hold it. A green LED. Okay, that LED needs a new life. Yellow LED. Isn't that cool? Those of us who were around before there were LEDs, how awesome it is. And if you really understand how LED wor LEDs work. Oh. So we... Okay, that's just really awesome, I like it. Um, the kind of cool thing you can do with the different colored LEDs, there's a whole huge range of things and I can't get off topic because you'll be staring at me in the dark with these bright colors here for a long time. Um, but the, if you ask kids which color of light has the most energy in it, what will the younger kids that have not been told, what will they say? Red, they always say red. Okay. Now, once a kid is told, and if they, you know, and then they're like, okay, yeah, I knew that. Yeah, but the kids will say red. It's hot. It, you know, you're going to think that has most energy. And you associate blue with cool light, not as much energy. Um, what I have up here underneath, so that the lights were off when I did this. Maybe I can get to it. Maybe not. Oh, wow, it's really dark. I'm impressed. Okay. I have a sheet of, if I can turn that. Oh, we have some groovy in the dark music. Oh, I could turn these off like this. Oh, look. It's like a club. Oh, that's so awesome. Okay, lovely. All right, so we'll turn all these guys on. And I've got a sheet of glow-in-the-dark glow vinyl up here, okay? Standard glow-in-the-dark glowy stuff. What color does it glow? Green, right? Okay, so here's my glow-in-the-dark glow vinyl. And it's not glowing at all. So I pick up the white light, and I just put it down here on the bottom. Well, that is immediately cool, because you're like, okay, this is fun. But to show the kids which color of light has the most energy in it, you take your LEDs, Mount them on some strip with some Velcro and do the following. Bam. Why? Well, different wavelengths contain different amounts of energy. You're like, but the red one. What if you leave the red one on there for a really long time? Three or four hours. <laughs> no. Cheap photoelectric effect demo. Photoelectric effect, you have to have the right amount of energy in the photon. It's not building up energy. It's each photon has to have enough energy to knock the electrons out. OK, great. I love it. Why green? Because glowy stuffs, phosphorescing stuff, have to absorb a wavelength of energy higher than what they then grab, become stable, and re-emit. So if you put the purple in, awesome! I could do equilibrium problems all day if I had a glow-in-the-dark board. Really? Ice table. <laughs> you have nothing at the beginning. Minus x, plus x. OK, <clears throat> now, listen to the AP Chem teachers laugh. You know you've all been ice tabling. Yeah, freaking ice table. OK, so um, anyway, that I thought was, I like that as a really great way to show the amount of energy in a photon.